Sul, Sul, we now Fredische, the Sims, and when last we left off, Dave and Yvette are working on getting one final promotion for Yvette. She needs to get one point of logic, and they need to maintain five family friends at the same time, which is easier with two Sims than it was with one. Unfortunately, Samuel is by himself in the house, and Melisande and Danielle can't make family friends for him, so he needs to find another family friend, maintain the five family friendships that he already has, and gain one point of charisma and two points of logic. You may think that's a rather tall order, but getting the skills at least isn't going to be that difficult. He can probably do that in the space of three days. Tomorrow he's not going to be going to work, because he doesn't need to, because he went yesterday, following in the tradition of Samuel not going to work the day after he gets a promotion. And there are some mice here that I'm sure that uh, Melisande is going to hunt down eventually. Alright, uh, you go and have some breakfast, and then you're going to go and practice your um, speech after using the toilet and having a shower. He's also going to be uh, cleaning the toilet, because if he doesn't, I don't think the maid's able to uh, path around him, and the maid won't wait for him to be done. She'll just occasionally uh, come over here, try and do it, and then it won't work. So we're going to uh, do that part of her job for her. There we go, and then we'll practice speech. Marvellous. The carpool will arrive in about an hour, but we're going to be ignoring it. And congratulations, your pet has earned a hunting skill point. I think for a grand total of that actually is not the phone for work. We are going to be answering that right now. I wonder what that could be. Is that a massive pile of money? I sure hope so, because a massive pile of money would be greatly appreciated. We're going to be ignoring that. A rich uncle has remembered you in his will. You get 200 simoleons. Excellent! We're going to be buying something with that extra money we were given. We're going to be buying another scratching post, because I forgot that um, the two cats don't have anything that they can use to improve their fun. And Melisande's fun is rather low. Alright, just ignore that the car is there, and focus on getting that uh, point of charisma. And after you've got that point of charisma and ignored work rigging you, you're going to be playing chess until you have uh, one extra point of logic. And there is that point of charisma. Marvellous! Time for you to play some chess now. For how long? Until you get that point of uh, logic that you're working towards. It's going to take quite a while. I mean, ooh, that is a different phone call. We should... Oh, well, never mind, we were going to answer that. And Claire Charming is no longer a family friend. That is to be expected, considering the fact that they have a 40-point difference between their relationship. I mean, uh, she probably has 48 in the positive with him, and he has 88 in the positive with her. And energy is really low right now, and bladder is also rather low. We're going to be working on uh, improving that bladder before he goes to bed, because uh, we don't want him to uh, eat tomorrow and then for his bladder need to bottom out. I know you're really tired, we're going to be working on that right now, and you definitely need to go to work tomorrow. Most certainly you need to go to work. Alright, sometimes I found actually that getting the uh, telescope can cause problems. Uh, I think once many years ago, a sim that was using the telescope simply disappeared forever. I mean, one moment I was uh, looking at the sim uh, using the telescope, and then I queued up other actions, and then they were gone. They just vanished into nothing. No event happened, they just weren't there anymore. Alright, it is morning now. Time for you to uh, do what you normally do, and uh, social there for Melisande is really low. We're definitely going to have to work on improving that eventually. Alright, you eat that breakfast, and we're focusing on uh, Danielle rather than uh, Samuel there. Alright, that has been done, and now this has been done. And hygiene is about to go uh, absolutely uh, to maximum. Excellent. And I think now we can focus on, uh, we could, uh, is Melisande awake? Melisande is not awake, so we're just going to uh, play chess for a while. And get a little bit more, ah, actually what we could do is we most certainly should fill up these bowls here, so that uh, hunger doesn't become an issue. There we go, and they have been filled up, and uh, you could play chess for a tiny bit longer, I was about to uh, tell Danielle to play chess there. If Danielle could play chess, that would be quite an achievement. I imagine we'll be getting bills pretty soon. I don't remember if it's today, but we definitely will be getting bills eventually. Is it today? 
The answer is, yes it is today! And, unfortunately, um, it looks like we're going to be losing that uh, friendship too. Fortunately, that is a friendship that um, Dave can maintain when we're controlling Dave. The uh, idea is that once Yvette has that final promotion, Yvette and Dave can focus solely on uh, having uh, Samuel as their only friend. We're definitely going to have to pay these bills right now, and I think, yep, Melisande has uh, just fallen asleep right there. And we need to, uh, there we go, how much is it? 345! That's not bad whatsoever. You actually have quite a lot of energy right now. So uh, playing a little bit of chess is, oh, is something happening? Nothing ever happens when that happens. We will never know what that was. But I think playing until about 10 o'clock, there we go, you just uh, stop doing that and then go get some much needed sleep. Marvellous. And now that um, those bowls are full, they can have all of the fun and all of the food that they require. Although we definitely need to socialize with Melisande later. We'll do that tomorrow. Also, your energy is pretty much maxed out, so any time that you're uh, just sleeping now is time wasted. Okay, time for you to do what you normally do every day. There we go. And hunger is pretty much maxed out now, and uh, you're awake, which is handy, because uh, we're going to have to interact with you at some point. Alright, the carpool will arrive, but we do not care for the carpool. He folds his arms in indignation, going, Work? I don't have time to work. I need to improve my skills so that I can go to work and get a promotion. Something about this seems a little counterproductive. But ah well, I'm just going to ignore the carpool now. The carpool was ignored. Marvellous. We have a uh, half of the, um, well, we're halfway through gaining that point of logic. Ah, right. Nearly done. Nearly done. A little bit more. A tiny bit more. That is not the phone call for, um, that is definitely not the phone call for uh, work. Can we answer it in time? The answer is yes, we can. Is it a massive pile of money? The answer is no. Your energy use has just spiked. You better be careful. Don't worry, we're going to sit in the other chair now, because we got that handy advice. And now we have all the points of logic that we need, which is excellent, and you are currently asleep. We need to work on uh, making sure that our relationships are maintained. And the first board of call for that is, uh, we can see if we can call Claire Charming over to say hello. Will she want to come over? That is only one way to find out, and that is to try and invite her. Would you like to say hello? The answer is, how nice of you to invite me. Excellent. We are definitely going to have to uh, wait for her to uh, talk to us. We have a tiny bit of time. Uh, we can't really do that much with it right now. He wants to just use this, which is fine. We'll let him. It can't hurt after all. And then we'll have him just clean this. There we go. Just to keep it nice and spotless. And I think, um, oh dear, we've now lost that family friendship as well. We've gone down from having uh, five to having three. But fortunately, they're not um, too badly uh, deteriorated, so we can work on improving them. All right. Here is Claire. Hello, Claire. How are you? I know we're not very good at maintaining this uh, friendship, but we'll try our best. Okay. How are you today? Are you well? Also, she's over there, Samuel, not over here. Hello! Nice to see you. We can have a conversation out here. It's not really going to make that much difference. All right, are you going to talk to us? Be talked to. That is fine. We'll have this interaction happen because it's most likely to work. When uh, Samuel talks to her, it never really works. Also, we now have that family friend back. And then we lost that family friendship. And then we gained that family friendship. So fickle is Claire. Also, be talked to. That's fine. We'll just have more conversations about parties. We're almost at 100, but she isn't at 100, so the longer we let her talk, the more likely it is that these numbers will uh, correlate. However, our long-term friendship here is pretty good. Is there any food? Or are you uh, interacting with... Uh, I think you're interacting with uh, one of the cats. Well, you're trying to interact with one of the cats anyway. Let's have a conversation instead, shall we? Or maybe we'll never have that conversation. No, wait, we're going to have that conversation. And it is a conversation that really didn't go anywhere whatsoever. Are you going to talk to us? It would seem like you're not interested in talking to us whatsoever. 
that's not surprising considering how uh, good their relationship is. Which is to say that it's never really been that good. Ever. Do you know what? Let's just uh, call somebody over and see if we can start a new friendship. Who shall we call over? I mean, we could call over Gunther. Gunther may want to actually know. Why are we calling over Gunther? He never wants to talk to Samuel. Ever. I thought you'd never ask. Oh, he does want to come over. Okay, fair enough. That was a little bit surprising. Also, we can talk to uh, her about cats. I don't think I started that conversation topic. Let's have a conversation. Nope, she does not want to talk about cats. That was a pretty terrible idea. We could try and uh, cheer her up, but that's really not going to work in the long run. Alright, where is Gunther? Gunther should be turning up at around about 8 o'clock. In general, uh, Samuel trying to maintain so many family friendships is not a good thing whatsoever. And uh, we just stopped her talking about cats because really that interaction never seems to work. It never seems to work. A tiny bit more time. And we'll just wait a little bit. Is she going to talk to us? I don't think she is. We're just going to say hello to Gunther then. We've tried many times to be your friend, but this time it's bound to work. Also, once again, uh, he's right there, not over there, Samuel. We're not going to be talking for that long. Is that a, uh, hear gossip? I don't really want to hear gossip right now. We just want to have a tiny amount of conversation. Will this conversation work? The answer is not really. Yeah, talking to Gunther really isn't working that well. Oh no, wait, we are getting pluses here. We now have plus 11, which is absolutely fantastic. Let's uh, try this again, shall we? One more conversation, and then we're going to tell you to leave, because let's face it, uh, we can't really have you uh, hang around for much longer. Mainly because, yep, because, uh, oh wait, Claire is going already. She is just too hungry. And now we're going to go to sleep before we fall unconscious in the middle of the, uh, the grass. Alright. Let's have a look, shall we? At what we're going to be doing tomorrow. Oh, apparently it's going to be answering the phone. Let's go and do that right now and hope it's a massive pile of money. We really need to spend our money. But I'm not sure what we're going to be spending it on. We're just sort of accumulating it with Samuel right now. We're pretty much going to be doing that all the time. You're a summer and should decorate accordingly if you want to live harmoniously in your house. I'm pretty sure he was told that he was a winter at one point, but never mind, eh? Back to sleep you go. And it is time for you to get up immediately. How is that so- Oh dear, that social for, uh, for Melisande is absolutely awful. Absolutely awful. If you're still awake when- Ooh, a uh, hunting point, that's not bad. If you're still awake when, um, he's going to work, unfortunately, actually, we don't have time for that. We barely have any time for the shower. You need to stop having the shower right now and head to work. Immediately. If you don't head to work, you could lose your job. No, you could lose your job here. Run, run, and you only just made it. That could have been absolutely terrible. Imagine all that effort to uh, get this promotion, and then he loses his job. That would have been... Also, we have now lost another family friend. Our efforts to maintain friendships are not going well whatsoever. I think tomorrow we're just going to have to spend a long time... Also, are you going to get up? You are going to get up, which is actually a perfect opportunity for us to uh, improve that uh, relationship that we have and uh, make sure that you are... Um, that you are not um, unhappy, Melisande, because you are not very happy right now. We need to uh, cancel that there and then interact with you. Alright, where are you going? I have no idea where you're going. But at least you're conveniently uh, putting yourself right next to Samuel. Hello, how are you? We're going to be doing this interaction quite a bit, because uh, your social is really, really low. Really low, and in fact, you're about to just fall asleep right now. We're just going to walk around there, and uh, that did not work at all. We're just going to have to wait until you're awake. We're just going to have to wait until you have more energy, which unfortunately will be when he is asleep. But we're not going to work tomorrow, so we have plenty of opportunity to improve that um, social need of yours, Melisande. Time for you to get up at 2 o'clock in the morning. Are you still awake? You are not still awake, but hopefully you'll be awake by the time that uh, Samuel is uh, starting his daily routine of trying to patch up all of his friendships. 
Danielle certainly awake, but we don't want to interact with Danielle right now. And Melisande is awake as well. And that uh, mood for Melisande is kind of grim. Alright, we'll just get this fun stat pretty much maxed out, and then we'll interact with you right now. Alright, we will uh, pet you numerous times here to make sure that you're very, very happy. Well, hopefully you'll be happy. Alright, that was a negative. And is this going to work? The answer is, I think that one did work. Excellent! It doesn't actually take that much for the, uh, for the social need to go up, which means that, um, then Melisande is in a happier mood, and is more likely to accept, uh, social interaction. Alright, we'll uh, do this a couple more times. Social is still pretty low. It is very low indeed, and I still can't believe that we nearly missed work uh, for a second day in a row yesterday. Which would have been awful. That would have pretty much been the end of... Uh, oh, oh, are you trying to go to work? Do not go to work! Cancel that plan! Just imagine him getting straight to the door and then being like, Come in, quickly, you're almost late! And then he's like, you know what, I've changed my mind. Nope, don't want to go to work at all. And then he didn't go to work. We need to uh, work on um, these family friendships right now. I mean, Tiffany is about to no longer be our family friend. So let's just give her a quick call and see if we can salvage that. We're just going to uh, call and have a quick conversation. Will this be enough? We're going to... Nope, that is not going to be enough. She is no longer our family friend whatsoever. We should probably just uh, ring uh, Gunther right now and uh, invite him over. There we go. He is actually at work. Can we actually do anything that will help us out? We're going to try. Also, uh, your social is a lot higher now, which is fantastic. Samuel, quickly, ring everyone that you know! Like Cameron here. Maybe he'll want to come over and say hello. We can salvage this relationship. We can make him our friend once more. We can. Excellent. Maybe we'll have him uh, have a quick nap. Why not? Just uh, sleep for a small amount of time. Not very long, however, because if you uh, sleep for too long, you will miss... Uh, oop, that is a phone call that we are going to ignore. And we're going to get up anyway, because we need to get up. Alright, you were thinking about the piano, but that's okay, because we're going to say hello to Cameron here. Hello, Cameron. How are you? Are you well? Don't mind the fact that I'm in my pajamas. I was just having a nap, because I didn't go to work today. Eventually we'll be able to say hello. Hello! How are you? I'm going to talk to you an awful lot until you're a good enough family friend that I don't need to talk to you for about... Aha! That was sufficient to, uh, once again be our family friend. We're going to talk to you a fair bit now. We do share quite a bit in common. And that is now up to, uh, 80, which is pretty impressive. We need this to be at about 100, though. Once it's at about 100, we can tell you to leave, and... I think we've nearly got to the point now where, uh, yep, I think it's time to say goodbye to you. You're pretty much now going to be our family friend for quite some time. And we could call, uh, let's call Yvette and have her come over as well, just to make sure that, uh, she stays our family friend for quite a while. And she does indeed want to come over, which is fantastic. You might as well do that, and uh, then fill up this bowl here. We're just going to make sure that all the family friends that he has are going to remain as such. Okay, and we have bills. We'll pay them right now, shall we? Why not? You know, you really should just hand them right to him. He is literally, he was literally there at that point. We'll just uh, drop these on the floor, and then we'll pay them. So that is a pretty strong family friendship. We're going to make this one pretty strong as well. This one we're going to have to repair at some point. Probably the day after tomorrow. Hello, Yvette. How are you? We're just going to shake your hand and uh, have a quick conversation with you. Ignore the fact that he is currently in his pyjamas. He's had a very long day. Alright, time for a conversation. Or two. Or twenty. Well, me... And they are getting on quite well, which is handy. We're just going to uh, improve this until it gets to maybe about 80 or 90. There we go, a little bit more. Just a little bit more. There we go, now it's at 80. And soon it's going to be even higher. It's at 90 now. It's safe to say that this relationship is going to last for a very long time. 
And then we'll need to focus on uh, probably repairing these two here. And um, that one's still going strong for now. And then we'll just have to talk to Gunther or somebody else for a while. But it's safe to say now that uh, you are very, very tired. You won't last much longer. Not even slightly. So you're going to uh, use the toilet here and then get some much needed sleep. And when we come back, folks, we're going to try once again to gain even more family friends as we have all the skill points that we need. All we need to do is repair this relationship. Dave could actually do that, which would be handy. Repair this relationship and then make friends with uh, Gunther and inevitably talk to Claire for a tiny bit so that uh, she becomes our family friend once again. So I'll catch you next time, folks. And I'll see you then. Dag, dag.